Hey everyone, this is Aran and I wanted to do a short video uh, about setting and achieving your goals. Um, this is just uh, something that I wanted to share um, because this is something that I do every day. I have um, a board above me where I actually have um, all my, my goals written for the next few months. Um, I have I have different targets that I set for myself, both uh, uh, financial and otherwise, um, in regards to things that I want to achieve. and. Um, I wanted to share why it's so important. Um, you know, I have a commission-based job, and uh, when you're on a commission-based job, your level of income determined is determined by your level of production. If you produce and you make money for your company, you get commission. The more you produce for the company, the more commission you get, the more money you make. And you know, in a job like that, you know, if if you have uh, no goals and all you your your goals are technically to just live week to week, month to month, or, you know, pay for your bills, you will never actually raise your level of income. Because I'm in a commission-based job and I have, like, financial targets which are, you know, they're high, you know, I set myself big targets, I, I actually get excited about um, going to work. I get excited about achieving some targets. And it's very important because when you, when you actually set targets which are very high, you probably get excited about it because you know, you're like, wow, I actually want to achieve this. You know, at least that's how it is for me. Um, I don't think anybody wakes up thinking they want to ach achieve uh, average life on, or have a boring life, really. Um, you know, because there's no point setting goals if you're going to have a boring or average life, you know. So if you're going to want to achieve uh, greater things, you definitely need to write down, okay, write down what it is that you want to achieve next month, the month after, next three months, the next six months, next year. And... Um, the second thing also is about setting it up, setting the goals. It's not just setting the goal, but actually then looking at for real what's it going to take to make it. Um, for example, every day when I uh, when I, when I wake up, when I get up to sit on my desk, you know, after having my breakfast or whatever, I sit down and actually write down what I'm going to write today. And having the the targets and goals just above my desk is very helpful because I stare at my goals every day, all day long, and I actually write down. Okay, great. So what what things I'm going to do today to be able to achieve that. And that also helps um, eliminate procrastination. It helps to eliminate working on needless needless actions. It, it helps reduce uh, activities which are not really going to be contributing to achieving these goals. Um, these goals change, you know what I mean? It's not that it always stays the same, but at least, at least they're there and it's something that you strive towards. So uh, that's my short tip for you. You know, write a goal. Or write several goals. I uh, look at it every day. You know, some people recommend to write a goal every day. I don't know. I, I I just once I set a goal, I stick it above my desk and I just go for it, right? And I write down whatever I have to do to achieve it, and I've got it all written down. And I just literally follow it step by step. And I, I lose very little time during the day because I actually work in a productive fashion toward achieving those goals. I always want to achieve it faster as well. Can't say that I'm perfect at it. But uh, these are my two cents worth in terms of uh, setting and achieving your goals. Hope this video has been helpful. Uh, feel free to like, comment, and uh, subscribe if you want more helpful videos. Thank you very much. Bye.